What's good ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy Richard. Today, I just want to talk to y'all about a change that's about to happen dealing with my uh, YouTube, I guess you can call it a show. Now, as most of my viewers know, when it comes to me and YouTube, I talk about anything and everything on here. It's not a set situation that I talk about, but it's kind of about to change to where I will be talking about you know one major thing but i will still keep my unboxing and i will still like if there's anything i bought new i will still like show y'all give a review on it if it's shoes like tronics whatever i will still talk about it but you know me i've been in the game uh of shoes and i'm just giving y'all my real credentials i've been in the game with shoes since what uh 1990 I was like nine years old. My uncle, he took me to this store in Cleveland, VIP. It was downtown Cleveland. And I remember he take, you know, he took me in there. He was like, yo, any shoe you want, you can get it. And it was like, I seen all these shoes. I seen the original bows and all these like shoes that nowadays people pay big time money for. And I just remember going to the Jordan section and I remember like it wasn't even a, a, a thought of a mind like I ain't even like double second think it was like I seen the, the hint of the reflection on the tongue and I just went straight forward and I was like yo I want these and that was what started me off in the Jordan craze now before that yeah I would see kids with Jordan's on I would want them you know, I had the typical parents where they was like, you know what, I can't afford that and the whole nine. And, you know, I understood it. I got it. You know, I was upset about it. But they still made sure I was laced up in the Nikes, the flights and all that, um, the Bo Jacksons, the Ken Griffey's, all that shit. But when it came to Nikes, Nikes was like the grail at that time growing up in school. Having Jordans on your feet going to school, it was like a whole transition. You felt like the king just for them few moments. Because as soon as you walked into that building, it was like everybody was looking at you. And everybody who you knew was like, oh, you got the J's. And it was like you were the man. Or you were the woman. Or girl or boy. Whatever you want to call it. It was like you was the one. And everybody and their mama. Talked to you. Hollered at you. The girl that you like waved at you. Hey what's up. Nice shoes. That was what I like. That was my first taste of the drug. Called Jordan's. And it was like ever since then, Christmas time, birthday time, that's all I wanted. I ain't want no toys. I ain't want Jack. I ain't want no video game. I wanted Jordans. And that's what my parents gave me. They was like, yo, instead of paying three, four hundred dollars on this game system, we can buy two pairs of J's and he'll be satisfied. <laughs> and I mean, that's just what it was. But now I'm 38. And I've been through each and every pair of J's in my life. Um, before I slowed down, I had a I had a nice collection. I had about a thousand shoes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, some was beat up, but I still kept them. But on this uh, YouTube show, that's my main thing. The shoes that's coming out, we're going to talk about them. You know what I'm saying? I might, you know, bring up the tablet so we can look at them on the tablet and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't have no fancy production, but I'm just going to try to keep it real with y'all. You know, basically, that's just the whole situation. Just keeping it real. Just talking about if I like the shoes, I'm going to give a poll. Like, ask, like, did y'all like the shoes? Just being honest and real. That's really the situation that's going to go down on here. But 
this your boy Richard. Thank y'all so much for checking this out. For all my people that are subscribers, I just want to say I thank y'all so, so much for subscribing. All my 370 subscribers, I thank y'all. I appreciate that. You know, hopefully y'all like these new segments, dealing with the shoes and all that greatness. Like I said, this ain't no hype beast. You ain't going to see a whole bunch of shoes behind me. No, we're going to pull up the tablet and we're going to conversate. And this is what the situation is. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying, before I get out of here, I do want to uh, say, give your boy a big thumbs up on this video. And also, at the same time, please get your subscription on because you will be the first ones with that subscription. Y'all be the ones to check this out before anybody else. You know what I'm saying? I'm not the one that say, oh, we got to get up to a 1,000 or 100,000. Yo, you like the show. You respect it. Just give your boy a big thumbs up and subscribe. If you don't, you don't have to. This your boy, and I'll let y'all later.